Okay, an old comes back in the shop for another video. Got a bunch of jobs to do on it. It's getting ready for the safety. I've been ordering parts for it for a while now. I'm starting to get a little small pile adding up, so I figured I better get to work on it. I brought in for safety a couple weeks ago. It didn't pass. He gave me a list. There's mainly body work it needs. But it needs a front left ball joint, r rockers, cab corners, sway bar links, bushings. Anyways, you see the list. Uh, I I've ordered some parts here. I've got the uh, sway bar bushings, ball joint. I've got the uh, U joint, and I got a third brake light, and then I got brake pads for the rear that it doesn't need for the safety. It's just a parking brake, but I'm gonna do them anyways. But um, today, right now, we're gonna start with the third brake light and get that done. Okay, so I'm starting with the third brake light. I'm doing it for a couple of reasons. Not only is it an easy job, it's just two star screws, but um, something's been leaking back here. I'm not really sure what it is. I, it doesn't seem to be this. I'm thinking it's the third brake light. There's a good gap here, and the seal looks pretty dried. But it might also be the back window, so I'm going to try this first, and it doesn't work anyways. But I don't know, it might just be a bulb, or it might be electrical, I'm really not sure. So we're going to try the new one, and hopefully it just works, and hopefully seals it up. I'm going to pop this out, I'll get a paper towel, dry it up, and then I'll get the new one in there. It comes with a new seal on it, so it should seal better anyways. It's, if it's leaking or not. Yeah, now I, I don't know, in case people don't know, this used to be my truck, I, I sold it about seven years ago and I bought it back last fall and I'm just doing some work on it, getting fixed up back to how it used to be again. And the, old guy, the guy who owned it last had plastic dipped it gray, that's why you see this here, I brought it back to white, we have to clean all that off. Got a, a Varsol Goo Gone mix here, and I'm going to start soaking this with a rag and I got a plastic razor blade and I'm going to start scraping this, cleaning this all off. Hoping it's not going to damage my sticker, but I'm going to try and easy on how much I put on there. I'm actually going to try and scrape some of this, this old seal off here before I get anything on there. Just because that will come off easy. It would be nice if I had two gloves, but this is my last one. Actually, oh, I guess it didn't get much sun. The rest of the truck, I, it was tough to get off, but it's actually peeling off here. Yeah, Barsol and Goo Gone mix works great for any kind of glue, anything like that. I find just the Goo Gone, it kind of grabs, and just Barsol doesn't really do much, but you mix them and it really eats away at it. Not the greatest to get on your hands, so. though. Alright, now I'm going to go over with alcohol, just to get all that off, I don't want any of that eating away with my seal on my new light.
Just in case any got in there, I don't want to smell it in the cab. Whatever. Alright. Big moment. I think we're ready for the new light. So this one's lined up, but this one here does not line up. Not wide enough. Alright, side cutters to the rescue.
All right, that's one thing off the list. What? <laughs>